There and as we experience these freezing temperatures, it's a reminder that some people don't have a place to warm up or sleep each and every night. Samaritan Ministries of Winston-Salem is working to fill that gap for many folks. This morning I'm taking a closer look at its men's shelter and the difference it can make in someone's life. This is our big eyes in the sky right here. So. Vincent Springs is a day monitor for Samaritan Ministries in Winston-Salem. He handles check-ins and watches over each room. Try to keep the builders safe. He says he is uniquely suited for this position. My job is, is, is really easy because I get to deal with me. Springs first came to Samaritan in 2018, not for a job, but a place to sleep. So you said this one? I was right. I'm just not right here. He was addicted to alcohol and drugs. I guess on my last leg, uh, I gave up in life. And didn't think anyone or anything could help until he stepped through these doors that he now oversees. You know, I've been to a lot of shelters, been homeless before, but it's just something different uh, about coming to Samaritan Ministries. The resources, information, the love of the staff, the look, just the, even the food. The, the, the meals, it, 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 just, it just gave me uh, another hope. Executive Director of Samaritan Ministries, Jan Kelly, says their men's shelter starts at the necessities. They have access to showers, clean linens, they can do their laundry, they have three meals a day. And that builds the foundation to help them move forward. The men come here and they can work on a housing plan, they can work on a plan for employment, they can work on a plan uh, for getting help with a behavioral health issue or a medical uh, issue. We really try to create that environment where they feel safe, uh, where they can trust people uh, so that they can move on with their lives. And for Springs, moving on means giving back. What it gives me is the opportunity to let people know you can overcome. It's not about me. It's to keep the doors open for the next person that needs it. And that is just one of the many programs Samaritan Ministries runs every day to help our neighbors in need. They are running their biggest fundraiser of the year right now, that being the Penny Campaign. You can donate online through the end of the year or in person this Saturday at a special event. Their drive through collection at Truist Stadium is happening from 9 a.m. until noon. It was really incredible to meet him and so many of the folks yeah. that work at Samaritan actually have been through a lot mm -hmm. of their program. I'm going to mm -hmm. introduce you to another one of those uh, tomorrow, tomorrow morning as well mm -hmm. so you can look forward to that. But a great campaign. Mm -hmm. Lainey Pope is the honorary chair mm -hmm. as well. So um, really looking forward to the event this weekend. Yeah, and the event this weekend.